All right, guys, we're out here at the Freedom Factory with Cletus McFarland, and we're gonna be learning. <laughs> we're gonna be learning how to drift today. Honestly, never drifted a car in my life, so he's gonna give me the full rundown of it, and we're gonna have a blast. Oh no! <laughs> We were going to the track. I think this is the shop first. Yeah, I think we have to get the cars first. If we're literally right next to the track. It Imagine like, having a shop right next to the track. That'd be so sick. And it goes house, side shop with the helicopter. Then it goes this shop is the main shop where they work look on at cars. This place. Race track is like the next step, like it all goes in order. <laughs> yeah, we need to step up the bridge game. We need to get Mo a box. <laughs> Put everything in. Yeah. There's so many the shirts. amount of shirts that are in here. Look at look at them. They're touching. <laughs> I love. I think this one thing that's like my favorite thing in the world is free clothes. There's a food place on the river we're gonna go to for lunch. Okay. Sounds good. Food and shirts. <laughs> what a crazy the best thing ever. I don't know why, but there's something to me when we go collab with other YouTubers that like when we get their merch, I wear the Heck yeah. Like I'm always in a C Boys hoodie. Yeah, yeah. no, oh, I wear C Boys merch all the time. Holy crap. Yeah. Oh this has to be a shop where he keeps all his cool stuff. Is that Damn. boat connected to Crown Vix? <laughs> no. No way. Stop! It's American flag life jackets on a pink boat. Can you raise the lamullets like that? <laughs> <laughs> That's the boat. It's like we'll the just challenge. throw one of the sea boys in the back. Holy freedom. Uh, dude, imagine how cool this would look in pictures. The palm trees with the American flag. Yeah. This is like a full race shop. This is sweet. See it. I know. I love it. I got McFarlane one. Marine. That's so sweet. Oh. What? This is a golf cart. What? How do you get a golf cart up there? Dude, look at this thing. Look at this thing. I think that's Leroy. I think this one's Leroy. It's, it's literally like the archer cart. Oh, you're right. It is. This is so sick. Those see, dashes see are so fits. nice. You can change them. You swipe over it, like changes all the same. Can, can you see if you fit in clear? There so ain't see. no way. Look at this thing. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I can see under the headrest. Ladies and I gentlemen, do. this is Halitus. Halitus? <laughs> Dude, the wheel. <laughs> I can see the dash in the top window of that car. I can't reach the pedals at all. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys can't tell, we're at Cletus's shop where he works on everything, and his drift car is actually here that we're gonna be taking over to the Freedom Factory and learning how to drift. So let's head on over there. The morning necessities. I feel dead without it, honestly. Like I didn't, I didn't grab one this morning. I had nothing. I was like, had some water, and then I walked in to um, his shop area and went to the fridge, and there was one sitting right there. I was like, you know, it's meant to we be. I'm gonna it. grab it's this. Yeah. <laughs> it's my first time, first time busting out this helmet. Yeah. Oh, I love it. It came out so good, dude. Look at the way when the sun hits it. I've never drifted anything in my entire life, so I should probably get a quick rundown. Yeah, you got some extra stuff. You got a handbrake that you use car. Uh -huh. but you'll be driving rocket. This is okay. a LS 240. Bags. So all set up, and then you just gotta rip it. It's okay. pretty easy. I think you got it. It's a good rundown. The outside takes some cojones just because if you don't go fast enough, it just pushes you down. Yeah. I think it will do the inside, and if you're feeling sporty, you can try and hit the yeah. outside rip. I think okay. you got it. Yeah, we'll try the inside first and see how that goes. <laughs> I don't want to get next to any walls too quick here. <laughs> I know nothing. I probably should have watched like a YouTube video tutorial. You got like, this. <laughs> it's a, I've never trained like an already pro driver. I'm amateur drifter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. This will slow you down on transition. So when you're coming into a corner, obviously more throttle is going to give you more angle. Yeah. Okay. So you'll kind of use that to adjust, but I'll just do one slow lap inside. Oh my god! I was not expecting that! Oh my god! <laughs> Oh, he's really good at this. <laughs> 
that, do one. Woo! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Dude, he's so good at this! Wow! <laughs> oh my god, the transition! Dude, this is sick! Oh, almost in the grass. Dude, it's so smooth! Dear Lord. <laughs> oh my god! And you can't hurt it, you can bang it off the limiter. Okay. Whatever you want. I won't hurt it, got it. He said I can't hurt it, so we should be all good. Yeah, put it on record that it'd be hard to blow that car out, so. Uh, that was insane. I've never really been in like some like a drift car like Same much. She was just chilling over there. <laughs> I was talking to myself. My helmet blocks a lot of the sound. It's weird being like near the wall sideways uh -huh, it's not cool. ideal in a lot of times dude that was so sick it was so weird not driving something like being in the passenger seat but like i fully trusted him like it, i usually don't trust people driving me at all that's one of like my worst things but like totally trusted i was like wow we were like <laughs> it's so fun i think you're gonna love it once you get it going i would say come out here in the middle of the burnout pad and just get like a one direction big loop going okay and then you can just switch it to the other side and then when you're feeling spicy, just freaking <laughs> go on the inside figure eight. Got it, inside got figure it. eight. <laughs> spicy. Did, did you understand what he was doing? I think so. So what were you saying? Because I heard you talking about like when you were braking, what it was doing, but I didn't so, hear fully what Yeah, you said. so like say you're coming around the inside, the car mm -hmm. is going to try and drive up into the grass. Yeah. So what you can do is apply a little bit of left foot brake. Mm -hmm. And like, the car is going to always try and drive in. Yeah. But if you use the left foot brake, it makes the turn wider for the okay. car. Even yeah. though you're going the same speed. And it won't like straighten it out super quick? No. You just put, start to slightly put Rain pressure it. and you'll feel the car kind of just start to go wider versus mm -hmm. trying to cut in. Okay. Same angle and everything. You might Touch need in. to turn that on for me. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to start out right here and then we'll go to like the figure eight. Not on the outside yet, but on the inside. I have no clue what to do. <laughs> Sideways to it, do the clutch in and try the handbrake, and you can feel it. it'll slow down the car but keep you drifting. Got it, okay. I feel like I just need a little fine tuning and I won't be bad. So, clutch kick when you do that. Okay, we're gonna try this again. All right, I think we're ready to go. All right, let's hit it. Let's do it. have to use for like a little, little bit and then uh, when you do the transition like kind of keep the wheel pointed in the direction you want to go and just let the tail come around okay it'll, like, be a lot smoother. if you turn it in if you like try and transition yeah it, it's gonna like really go where it wants around. to got it that was good <laughs> got it. we're getting better every time keep a little bit at a time
I know, I'm struggling with like the wrap around, like how it like just wraps around. So I would say, all right, here's what you gotta do. Stay in first. Okay. And when you, when you go around this, and when you come out here and you're back on the concrete, just put a little bit of left foot brake pressure on uh -huh. it. And then stay on the brake until it's through the transition and that'll kind of slow everything down. Okay. And then you just jump right into that side. You okay. got it, you're right there. Okay, we'll try that. First gear? First gear, yeah. Hi. Uh -huh. We might be banging out shit. <laughs> oh. He wouldn't even let me touch the little bar. The handbrake? So, yeah, I mean, she's doing amazing. The fact that she's transitioning on the inside. Already? It's been like five minutes. I know! I'm like, no wonder she's so talented. <laughs> Tell me when. There we go! <laughs> little jump start. Alright, we gotta cool it down. Couple laps, couple laps. <laughs> I'm getting this thing a little warm. Dude, I gotta get my line down for the Le Mola series coming up. I'm gonna get better at that transition. What's our water temp? Oh, no, we got no gauges. Alright, let's try this again. surprised if you break it. <laughs> Leave them up to me. <laughs> well, if they get real hot and then you turn them off, like the water's got to go somewhere. So it'll just leak out and we'll just top it off and it's good. Okay, not that bad. No, no, it's not fine. It was just hot because we did like four laps, but you were freaking ah, kept it going. That was a lot better. Once I had some coaching to like yeah. Stay right here, go right here, it helps so much. Because like you wanna, when you get out of there, you wanna go you straight wanna to it. But, but I'm like, you gotta going. go this way, and then you gotta go that way. Yeah. No, <laughs> that helps so much. Good that job. made a huge difference. You did a great job. <laughs> All right. Yeah, just ruin the water pump. That's okay. <laughs> we got it. All right. <laughs> 
Yeah. Not a big deal, happens all the time. <laughs> the amount of fun this has been is like top tier. Coming out here, like I didn't expect it to be like this much fun and this crazy. And it's just like learning how to drift. It's it's hard. It's really hard, especially from someone who's never done it before, trying to learn it all in one day. But like once you start getting the hang of it, you're like, yeah. Well, map sensor is bad on that car, so she's. We need to replace it. Tough break for today. <laughs> it says she can't break it, and then the sensor I goes down. Broke bad. it? No, it's like a sensor. It's like a sensor, so I broke it. So <laughs> it'll run on all eight perfect, and then you give it a little bit of airflow, and then it just shuts. Off. You told me that there's no possible way you can break this car, and I will be really impressed if you, you do. <laughs> Every time I say that, it comes back to bite me. But <laughs> <laughs> see, you should, see, there's a double negative. There. <laughs> you did good though. I mean, you picked it up instantly. I would like to do some tandems, but you'll have to come back. And yeah. We'll fix the two. Oh, we'll be back for a little mullets. For sure. Well, we can make something happen, no. but that was still fun. I'm glad I got to learn how to drift and stuff. So if you guys haven't already, check out Cleus' channel. I'm sure you have already, but for those of you race fans that haven't, check out him. He does a lot of crazy stuff here at the Freedom Factory, and we are going to go have some more fun, hang out. But be sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, check out Club HD and shop Give me all of your lies, cause you're my